take my hand and together we'll vlog. So, I've started the list. This is my phone and it's where I keep all of my notes and I just updated it so I have to type in a passcode. But I've started the list. Can we see the list? It's very bright. There it is, the list. Today is Friday and on it it says simple how to slash life hack tries. I thought about trying a life hack and I went to lifehack.com and the first thing that came up was that it normally takes people 70 hours plus hours to watch 100 TED videos and you can learn all the things from 100 TED videos in five minutes and it was just a quick list it was like one the information and just one to 100 100 though is probably my favorite TED video which is the JJ Abrams TED video and it's the mystery box and it talks about how he's had a box with a question mark on it which is his mystery box and he's had it for 35 years um, because the potential or the unlimited potential of what is inside of the box and the mystery of that is more important to him than the actual worth of the $15 uh, box that his grandfather bought him, bought him years ago. Also, it's kind of a, a remembering his grandfather type thing. And anyway, moving on. Wow, already talked for a minute. This piece of paper, it is roughly two feet long. Um, roughly, because I didn't measure it, it is the instructions to an external hard drive. Now, what I'm going to teach you in this video is how to make a paper hat, because I like wearing them, and heck, why not? So, the first thing you're going to do is you're just going to fold the paper in half from uh, lengthwise, that is, not, um, not lengthwise, from, wow, terminology, should have thought that through. Anyway, this is the longest way to hold up the paper. Fold it in half there to make a square. I cannot think of the other terminology because you're not, yeah, for that. But anyway, and then what you're going to do is you're going to fold the corners into the center. This is really easy for me because I already have creases on mine because I already folded it into a paper hat earlier. Now, this is where other people would cut the paper at the bottom to make it closer to a square. I tell you, do not do this but simply fold it up. And rolling it up can help keep the hat closed on either side. So you're going to want to give just a little past. So this, see, this is where the square is here, right? So where the triangle meets the corner. This passes it up a little more than I'd like to. So like it sticks up a whole lot. So I'm going to actually fold this not with where the paper naturally folded because it was like an insert but a little lower than that. So that about a centimeter of the paper, showing it from the same again, only about like a, a centimeter. That's actually closer to an inch. I thought it was like a centimeter, but you know, it's a smaller amount than was there before, which is about two and a half inches sticking up. It sticks up. So then we'll do that for both sides. And the fun thing about starting to do how-to videos is if I just do them this way, they're all going to be terrible. So I won't do them this way, but I'll get better at it. Okay, so now that is like our top line, and we want to fold both sides up to meet that. So folding in half what was left over there at the bottom. So that was left over there at the bottom. All right, we're just folding that in half to meet that point. So, you know, working in a pharmacy for years and being able to, having to fold paper with almost one hand, I've actually gotten really good at folding paper. And I think we can actually get another fold out of that. It's not going to come all the way up, but it's going to be just to where the paper almost feels like it's going to rip here at the corner. See, that did actually rip. So that's just below that is where I'm going to fold that again. And those folds and that pressure created by that actually help whenever you wear the hat to keep it from unraveling. So do that on both sides. Now, I will show you. So on this side, you can't see. Like, you, you have the big one and the small fold. On this side, it actually sticks out. Like, there's a little lip here. See that? It's okay if it doesn't meet up. Cause it's a freaking paper hat. People don't care. And there you go. You can, you can wear your paper hat. Does it look good in my paper hat? I like paper hats. That's all I have for you. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel, comment below. I know this is a little long, but hey, whatever. I want to do something different. Oh, also, you cannot comment anymore on YouTube videos unless you are linked up. 
But I did find this out. You can go to Google Plus before you do that and make your name whatever you want it to be. So Suave Maurice became my name on Google Plus and is still my YouTube account name because I'm awesome. That's all I have for you. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, share, like again, share some more. Maybe do your own version of this video and show me the hat you made. Because the thing about, you know, like video responses is all you have to do is like copy my title and put RE before it. And I'm pretty sure I'll see it because it'll like show up in the sidebar and stuff. Or you could send it to me as a message. You could tweet it at me. I'm going to shut up now. That's all I have. Bye.